All right, Fire Nation's free fans, I'm so excited today because we've got that new Halloween collection of the plush line. And this is really exciting because we've already got figures based off Christmas, Easter, and now, oh yeah, I checked out GameStop.com and we've got the new Halloween plushies sent to us by GameStop. And the first one here, oh look at him, all in plastic, is Dreadbear, oh, the main character of this awesome franchise. So get this guy out of the baggie here. Oh, I can't wait to see what this guy's all about. Oh, there he is, good old Dreadbear, which is the awesome Halloween skin of good old Freddy. Oh, love it. And of course, what a great plushie. He looks very Frankenstein-esque. Oh, I just love it. He's got that bolts on the side of his neck and they're sewn in there. So that's pretty cool. He's got that blank stare. He's like, uh, Dreadbear, I'm gonna get you. <laughs> Oh, he's got the black nose, which is, uh, well, the regular one has that. He's got the big old teeth up front. He's like, Rrr. And up top, we've got the cool top hat and the ears, which there's a big old mark out of it. That's pretty cool. And then down below, ooh, this is where things get crazy because we can see right into his exoskeleton body. He's got stitches. And I love the overall color of him, too. He's like a dingy brown tannish color. So yeah, it looks like Freddy here has been run out into the mud and uh, stitched together like a Frankenstein. <laughs> the little bow tie. Wow, that is one little bow tie. Blinking, you'll miss that thing. Ugh, crazy. And the hang tags this time around look like this. And yeah, Fight is the Freddy's Curse of the Dreadbear line. Oh, I love it. Good old collectible plush for this Halloween. <laughs> With the big old pumpkins and everything. Cool. So there's the backside. Oh, you can get more little pumpkins right there. Nice, and of course, we get three other plushies to go along with this one, making four in all. So let's go back to our GameStop box and see who else we can find in this lineup. And next up, oh, we got a level old Foxy. Yeah, it looks like he is next in our uh, plastic here. So th there he is. Wow, Grim Foxy coming at you. And he's all Halloweened up. Boy, that is so cool. Look at his eye. <laughs> Big old yellow eye. That's cool. He's got the patch on the other side. Cool. He's got two rows of teeth. Stripes in his ears. This is the first time they've actually given us a hook for his hand. So that's pretty cool. I love that. And the colors on this guy is really neat. I love how they actually used the imprint on his body. They didn't stitch it in. It actually looks like it's glowing in the dark like there's a candle inside this guy. So cool. There's old Grim Foxy. Yeah, it looks like his hang tag is the same. Yeah, this is pretty cool to get him in plushy form because the only other way we've gotten him so far is with this little uh, minifigure by McFarland Toys. And I gotta say, wow, that looks great. Put both these guys side by side and we've got ourselves both Grim Foxies that they've released so far. You know, I mean, heck, we haven't even got him in the Mystery Minis line, which is kind of weird because usually when they do the plush, they have Mystery Minis to go along with it. In fact, we haven't even got Mystery Minis of the Christmas line and the Easter line either, so, uh, huh, makes me kind of wonder if they're holding off on doing Mystery Minis until they've got all the Halloween-themed characters out and they can just do one huge line of Mystery Minis for all the holidays. Boy, that'd be a great idea, and I hope that's what Funko is thinking. But until then, well, we got some more plushies to look at to get all this filling out of here and get our next plushie out of here. Oh, look at that, oh man, it's Jacko Chica. This is that cool Halloween themed duck that we just love. And this is the awesome alternate version of good old chick here that's been Jacko lanternized. Ah, oh, for great measure, oh, I just love this thing. Cause look at those two bright yellow eyes. Looks like a big old jack o lantern and I just love how they did this plushie because it looks like it's there's like a candle inside her and she's just lighting up inside oh <laughs> look at that we can kind of see inside her exoskeleton there the big old pole in the middle of her torso it's pretty cool and the let's the let's eat bib is all chewed up and ugh, looking all mangled there cool we got the cool feet <laughs> and they're not little stubbins they're actually webbed that's pretty cool too and i look i just love all the colors Ah, oh, that's so cool. So yeah, there's good old Chica. And if you wanted Jacko Chica in the past, well, they actually got a little mystery mini of this character. But yeah, it looks just like the plushy here, only without the uh, jack-o-lantern in her arm. Ha <laughs> ha so cool. And if you wanted her in the Articulate series, well, they made her too. 
But oh, good luck trying to find her because she is super expensive right now. And it's kind of weird because I remember seeing her at cleanups for at GameStop for like five bucks at one time. Can you imagine? Oh, holy cow! But yeah, there's our awesome Jack Go Chica coming at ya. So what a great character of Jack Go Chica that we can put alongside our other two ooh, Halloween themed characters. Three in all, but ooh, it looks like we're missing one. And that would be the character of Bonnie. Let's see, it looks like, ooh, we get the version of Jacko Bonnie for this cool Dreadbear series. Yeah, oh man, look at this awesome character. Wow, so colorful, I love it. So he looks exactly like Jacko Chica, only in Bonnie form. Wow, I love it. especially the bow tie. Look at that, it's all bright orange. And we get bright orange for the uh, snout there. That's pretty cool. We get two rows of teeth. Gotta love it. I just love how one eyeball is just like smashed in there. Oh, crazy. It goes all around to the back of the face. That's pretty cool. The, the one eye is all lit up like a jack-o'-lantern. Oh, I love it. We get the little Mexico skeleton. It's pretty. And then the ears. Gotta love the ears. They're kind of reminiscent of what we see with good old Foxy here. So, yeah. Battle of the ears. Ba -ba 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 -ba. So cool. But, oh, I just love this character. He looks pretty cool too. And then there is his hang tag. And of course, if you want Jacko Bonnie in another form, well, they never made one. Never appeared as a Mystery Mini or in the McFarlane line. But it is cool because he will be showing up in the Articulated line later this year. But for all you fans of Jacko Bonnie, oh, we finally got him alongside Jacko Chico, which is awesome. Then, of course, if we bring out our Halloween versions of Freddy and Foxy here, oh, we've got our complete set of these scary monster skins. Ah, oh, just love it. So yeah, this is the brand new lineup from Funko, available now, all the way through Halloween, I'm sure. So yeah, Curse of the Fredbear line coming at you, and these look great. And if you love that, well, make sure you check out these awesome Jurassic Park toys by Numskull. We've got these really cool tub duckies based on a couple of the characters from the movie. <laughs> oh, they look so neat. Then we got this awesome pencil pouch. Wow, with the Jurassic Park logo on it. Oh, I love that. I'm going to take that to school with me. Then we got these awesome Jurassic Park glasses. But the coolest thing, however, has to be this Jurassic Park desk lamp. Whoa, we got to get this out of here. Watch out of the package. Oh, so cool. Big old Jurassic Park logo on this lamp. And it looks like there's a button right here. Oh, it lights up too! Oh, turn out the lights! Ah, <laughs> yeah! This is definitely something I want to sleep with. The cool Jurassic Park light. Oh, that is perfect. So yeah, that is by Numskull, which you can find at stores now. So yeah, this is the brand new lineup from Funko, available now, which helps fill out our holiday collection with all these great characters. You can probably find these at GameStops, Hot Topics, Targets, and more, so look for them now.